What's up, guys? I'm Paula Ilanze from MajorFilmEvents.com, and I'm here at the TCL Chinese Theater on Hollywood Boulevard celebrating the 14th annual Holly Shorts Film Festival. I've been talking with different actors and filmmakers, and they've been telling us about their projects, and I'm so excited to see what they're working on. So tell me, what's the name of your film, and give me a little bit about it. Well, okay. Okay. Uh, the name of the film is Ovum, and basic O-V-U-M, okay? And it's basically a, how a reclusive um, isolationist uh, fisherman uh, comes across this mysterious discovery on the beach, which is an egg, and how that kind of alters his life indefinitely because of this discovery, because of this finding. Tell me about the creation of this. What, where did you come up with this idea? Well, I came up with this idea because I grew up going, spending summers in this beach in Argentina where we shot the film. It's a very remote place, it's a very remote beach. As you see in the movie, there's nothing as far as the eye can see in every direction. So I knew, I knew this place, I knew this, this uh, routine of going fishing on the beach, so I kind of, my grandfather used to take me here, so he's the inspiration for his character uh, as the lonely fisherman that drives a jeep onto the beach. So we, we added the supernatural aspect of it to get the story going. It's the catalyst that gets things in motion when he's fishing one morning and he finds this gigantic egg, which is an anomaly, it's something abnormality, you've never seen anything like this. And even though this character, you can sense that he has spent his entire life at sea, he's never seen anything like this. So, and nobody has, so that's when things start to get suspenseful because obviously you're trying to wonder what's in, what's in here. He brings it home and the rest, uh, you, gotta, you gotta watch the film. So by, by gigantic egg, like how big? I need to get like an estimate in my mind. <laughs> I'm gonna give you a picture, it's worth a thousand words. Oh, the picture. This is the egg. <laughs> you see it? Cool. And then about the title, what ovum? Is that the name of the egg? It means egg in Latin. It's, oh, here's another aspect. It's, neutral, it's a neutral name that any language can understand. But also, the film has no dialogue. Why? Because he's alone in this place. He's alone in this isolation. So he's up against this thing all by himself with nobody to share it. So this is a very challenging role for, for as a as an actor yeah. to have no dialogue so it's all very internal and, and you have to be subtle well he can tell you more about that I bet this is your first time playing a role with no words um well in, in <laughs> on this scale on this level yes I mean um in University of Miami I, I acted in, in some short films that were silent but nothing nothing to this degree I mean that plummeted this kind of um imagination and creativity and uh uh, work. Okay, so take me through preparation for this, for filming every day. Uh, well, I mean, Luciano and I did a fair amount of rehearsing. Um, he loves to rehearse, uh, and so do I. Um, I. I created a backstory for the character that I, I do with all the roles I do, which I think is essential to get all the specifics down and kind of, um, you know, really kind of charge you or thrust you forward into the role. Um, and, and basically uh, did a lot of fishing. So is this your first year at Holly Shorts? First time, first first film at Holy Shorts. Okay. Pretty exciting. And you? Yeah. Yes. Yep. Same. How has it been for you so far? It's been great. It's been a, it's been an amazing experience. Um, I I I've seen some great short films, uh, some great films in general, and uh, we're we're very honored to be here. Likely the same. And we we live down the street here, so it's a privilege to be able to just walk down the hill, in your own town, and have this quality of films like a feast, eight days of this stuff. It's a real privilege. All our friends are showing up. It it's, couldn't be better. Well, I'm looking forward to seeing it. Are you guys on social media? Yes. Right, can you share it with me? Over movie across the board. Okay. <laughs> uh, even overmovie.com and our names.com also. Yeah. Okay. And what about you, personal social media? Uh, just uh, uh, Facebook's the best way to, to follow me. Yeah. And it's your personal last name? Yeah, Jason Gladstone. Yeah. Right. Jason the one. <laughs> well, thank you very much, guys. This was a unique viewing experience because instead of seeing just one film, I saw tons tonight. And it was amazing. I mean, some of these people were here for the first time. Others were here for the 14th time. Either way, the talent was amazing. And you definitely want to make sure you're here next year. So stay tuned to MajorFilmEvents.com. You never know what's next.